Hi everybody, in this video I am going to uh, solve the following problem. Consider the grammar G, S, A, V, S, P. P consists of, these are the production rules, S to A, S, B, S to A, Epsilon. What will be the language of the grammar uh, solution? We know G equal to B N summation P and S. B N is the set of variable, summation is the input alphabet, P is the production rule, S is the start symbol. Given uh, G equal to S A V P S. Comparing 1 and 2, we get B N equal to S. That is only start symbol. Summation input alphabet that is equal to A B. P is given above and S is start symbol. S equal to start symbol. Now we need to uh, find the language of the grammar. We know the language is generated from the start symbol. So, S equal to A, S, B. Now, we can uh, replace S again. A, S, B, A. Uh, this B. Yes, S to A, S, B. Replacing S as A, S, B. And putting again and again, we get A to the power N, A, S, B to the power N. Finally, uh, when we put S to A, epsilon, that become A to the power N, B to the power N. Now, the language is LG equal to A to the power N, B to the power N, such that N greater than equal to, this is the very important thing. Here, S creates an empty symbol. So, when N equal to 0, that will be empty. So, N start from 0. Uh, in case of S is uh, not epsilon, then N will be 1. So, uh, from the above problem, language of the grammar is A to the power N, B to the power N and n is greater than equal to 0. Why n is greater than 0? When n equal to 0, then we get empty symbol. And n equal to 1, there is a, b, n equal to a, b, b, and so on. So, in this video, I have discussed uh, how a language can be created from the grammar. So, thank you very much for watching this video. Share and subscribe it. Thank you.